Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be going through the mess that is my crafting supplies. I switched up my craft room once again. So I do this every season because um, I'm always switching things around. Especially with my business, um, I had two different places where I had everything. So I had like my office side and then where I do the crafting side and then it was just too much. That's something that I finally had to sit down and say, okay... All of my supplies, my office work, everything is going to be in one place. So I did that yesterday. I pretty much tore apart the whole room. So my whole craft room was in shambles yesterday. I went through every single thing. And I decided that, you know, I don't do paper crafting as a hobby. So a lot of the things that I was just hoarding and holding on to, I, I just, I have to let go. And I have to find it all a new home. So that's what I started yesterday. My my office, my craft room, it's it's done. So everything that's in here are stuff that I know I'm going to keep, that I know I need. I just have to do some organization, but I have to put stuff up on the walls. And usually I let my husband do that because he's good at all that. He's the handyman. I... I suck when it comes to that. I did leave a mess in his garage. So before the weekend comes, I want to, um, you know, fix all that up because I, I believe he, he has to work on his cars this weekend. So I don't want all of my stuff to just, you know, be there. I want to clean it up for him and then I'm going to make piles because this weekend I also have donation coming. So I want to make piles of things that I can sell and things that have to go to donation, things that I have to trash. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to show you the mess that I have to work with right now. I need some coffee for this because it's a lot. But yeah, let me show you real quick what I'm working with. And um, I'm definitely gonna do a de-stash video after this one because I, I just, I need new homes for all of these things. I don't want to fully donate them because I have donated a lot of my craft supplies already. So I wanna kinda just get back a little bit, even like a fraction of what I put into it. De-stash video coming up next. Right now I'm going to show you the mess that I have to work with. I have all of this here and underneath all of this there are more things down there. This is Valentine's Day stuff, Valentine's Day stuff, um, Christmas, that's all of, full of Christmas. Paper shred, I have a whole bunch of envelopes, 12 by 12 stuff, a whole bunch of stuff over there. I have this that's going to donation. This is all stuff as well. Some I got rid of a whole bunch of storage pieces. I have all that in there, 12 by 12 paper packs. I've got all of my Halloween stuff that I know I should look through this and de-stash, but I think I'm gonna keep it because I just love Halloween. I have um, more storage up here, and then this is going to donation as well. Oh, this is also donation because I don't even use this wrapping paper. So I'm gonna make piles now. I'm gonna label them, or at least I'm gonna try to categorize them. I have everything sorted out. So we have Valentine's Day de-stash, we have Thickers de-stash, Christmas D stash in here we have um what's this over here okay we have travel D stash Disney D stash this pretty a harmony by Minte I believe and then Disney by Frank Garcia D stash over here we have this 12 by 12 D stash which I'm not gonna do YouTube I'm gonna do it on an app why why am I gonna oh because it's too heavy um and then this is not D stash my son just helped me put that this big box is donation actually i don't know if anybody would be interested in this like something to alter a little tv i don't know maybe i'll put it aside for these stash these are going to my sister return from walmart and then i have these boxes over here that i think i'm just gonna put locally i'm gonna put them up for sale locally or maybe free i don't know i just i don't want to have to ship this i did say that i had to go through my um my halloween stuff i think i'm gonna wait till about you know halloween time and then i'll go through it but for the meantime i'm keeping everything in here okay so i'm finally done with this room you know what let me say i'm about 98 percent done i moved a lot of stuff around it's definitely more functional for me and i got rid of a lot of stuff like i said i already have a d-stash video coming up next so if you guys are interested make sure to check that out i also added well my husband added an ac here so that's nice because it keeps the room nice and cool especially now during the summer i think i will give a tour full in-depth tour once i am completely done that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching and i'll talk to you guys next time bye